Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Today's topic is the frequency modulation side bands. In frequency modulation, when carrier wave is modulated, a number of side band is formed. In frequency modulation, when carrier wave is modulated, a number of side bands are formed. Number of side bands are formed. Suppose we have a center frequency that is the carrier wave frequency having the frequency F0. Okay. Carrier frequency when it is modulated with the modulating signal uh, having the frequency Fm. Modulating signal having frequency Fm. So we can see that how it is modulated, how the uh, frequency sidebands form. Theoretically, there are number of infinite number of sidebands created, uh, uh, created side by side the Fm. Let's suppose here is one sideband Fm, F0 plus Fm and here the sideband. Both sidebands are apart from the uh, frequency with the frequency Fm and uh, this form become F0 minus Fm where this F0 plus Fm, this is the positive frequency and this is the negative frequency. And the other uh, band will be having the uh, low frequency that is F0 minus 2 Fm. And here the second one having the low frequency that is F0 minus uh, plus 2 Fm. Similarly, uh, the next frequency will be F0 plus 3 Fm and here F0 minus 3 Fm. And gradually the strength of these sidebands uh, going to decrease. And after some sidebands, uh, their strength will be negligible. They lie on the, these bands lie on the both sides of the center frequency. That is one band is in the positive direction and other band in the negative direction. If we are supposing that if F0 if F0 is the center frequency and Fm is the frequency of is the frequency of modulating signal Then in the above spectra, we can mention number 1, that is F0, that is the frequency of the carrier wave. And the second one, the second band, that is F0 plus minus Fm. The third one is the third band, that is F0 plus minus 2Fm. So on the fourth one is just like F0 plus minus 4 Fm. And here we can have an infinite number of the bands, whereas the strength of the band is going to decrease after each band. So, we can calculate the bandwidth of the spectrum. Because the bandwidth mean the space or the frequency between the two extreme that if we are considering this band and this band this positive band this negative band 
then the bed width will be uh, between this positive and negative bed. Now the bed width of spectrum is bandwidth that is two time because this is the one time and this is the second time so we can write as 2 n f m where n is the highest order significant band where n is the highest order significant band another expression for the uh, for spectrum bandwidth this is the first expression and we have also another expression for calculating the bandwidth the other will be like this the another expression For spectrum bandwidth, we can write as bandwidth is equal to 2 times 1 plus mf fm and we know that what is mf, mf is the modulation index which can be represented by delta f, uh, delta f deviation of the frequency divided by the fm that is the frequency of the modulation mm -hmm. by substituting the value of mf in this equation we will get bandwidth is equal to 2 times 1 plus delta f divided by fm into fm by taking the lcm of this 2 we get fm plus delta f fm uh, we can cancel the fm with M, uh, MF, uh, M, FM, with FM, now the bandwidth is equal to this. So, this expression shows that the sideband having the amplitude, the sideband, which is located here. The sideband is this, the sideband is this. The sideband having the amplitude less than 5% of unmodulated carrier wave will be negligible. Okay, so it's been uh, in this article we have to investigate about the frequency modulation sideband and the frequency, frequency modulation sidebands uh, occur uh, on both sides of the center frequency F0 and that is F0 plus FM and that is F0 plus FM and they, they are equally distributed, uh, they are dist equally located from the central frequency. Uh, this is for uh, uh, FM, F0 plus FM, the other will be F0 plus 2 FM, the th third will be F0 plus 3 FM and so on. And these frequencies lie on both sides of the central frequency. Okay, thank you very much.